Welcome to my 13th Deadman mode video. In the last video, we got a max kill and upgraded to full Ancestral, and today we have even bigger goals. I eventually want to turn this Ancestral to Virtus, but first I want to turn this Carols into Armandil, or even better, full Missouri. Now we're still in bracket 4, and there's a lot of loot to be claimed here before moving up, so let's get into it. Shout out to Jax for sponsoring today's Deadman video. We are just about 2 weeks into the tournament, but it's still not too late to catch up and have some fun, as well as compete. It ends in mid-September, but with 5 different combat brackets and boosted XP rates, you'll be able to catch up in no time. It's a PvP focused temporary game mode, and the biggest and best change this Deadman are these new breaches. Breaches are 15 minute events that happen 3 times a day where bosses from all over Gilinor spawn, and they don't stop spawning. They drop some crazy loot for everyone involved, so don't be discouraged, as I guarantee it'll be some of the most fun you have on RuneScape. If you want to learn more, click the link in the description that will link you to the Dead Man blog, which will give you all the info you need to start today. Thank you once again to Jax for sponsoring today's video. Oh shit. Oh shit, so this guy's got Barrage too. And I'm frozen next to him. Come on, I've shown him the VLS, now I can cross him, I bet. Whack that. Oh. Come on. Oh, what? Is that a refreeze team square? I think it is. Seven, nineteen, twenty-nine 29 for the KO as he was about to go up the stairs. I just came from the Slayer Cave. I was on someone in big risk. And I found someone else in big risk. This guy was a PK or he had AGS and a very nice PK and setup for me to take. Thank you, mate. 2.2 mil loot. He had a bolt switch? Ooh. A snack just teleported into me. If I can catch the freeze, that is. Don't tell me he's got me. There we go. Move the VLS there. Karasi that? Oh, ho, ho. he prayed melee, and the Karasi took him out the game. Dude, this guy had like seven glories on him. Was he at the Fountain of Rune? You're doing that for money. This could be a really good key, if so. Either way, those glories are going to sell for like over a mil easily. Check out what these three keys are. One mil, 300k with a bunch of cash. That's actually the best key, probably. All right, I need to buy the Porcupine Sigil back that I've been selling this whole time. Unless I have it. Yeah, I don't have it. I'm going to use it for the Breach that's upcoming. And I'm going to take off aggression. All right, the breach is coming in a minute. Let's get ready. Something tells me I'm going to run into that PK again. I teleported into the breach at Canifis looking for some loot. And that Spoodward guy who we almost killed for Max in yesterday's video hopped on me instantly. Less. Oh, that's off prayer too. I tried to get him as far away from the bank as possible, but unfortunately, as soon as he's unfrozen, he ran straight to the bank. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of bank fights, especially during a breach that only lasts 15 minutes. There's only so many people you can kill in that amount of time, and you can bank fight wherever. So I got out of there and headed back. Oh, bro, I'm actually already on this guy who just got the javs drop. What the hell? I didn't even realize, I just added him to my fucking friend finder and I was already on him. That's crazy. 41. He's not gonna pray melee, is he? Oh, he is, but it's a little bit too late. Bought that? Dead. 35. Is that a bunch of jabs? You're. Oh, okay, that was someone else who said that. Did I get his jabs, is the question. 
Surely he got them, right? Yeah, 50 jabs. Nice. That's a bank kill. That's literally almost 10 mil, if not more, probably. Taiyi Wagi, have you lost that? 45. As he goes into the Rex, he's dead. 48. Oh my god. I just destroyed that guy, dude. I just destroyed that guy. Let's take it all. Bank key. <laughs> Scythe the lot. He may. Trinket of Advanced Weaponry, I think I saw in there too. I want to peek here. Freeze it. Surely, right? BLS. Oh, I don't even have spec. But where's the freeze at? Come on. Big hit. BLS, nice. Crossy? Oh, how did he predict that? Freeze. Nice. Feel us? Dead. Dead. Surely. Good fight, that's a PK out the game, GG dude. He fought me back, so a lot of respect to him, to be honest. GG. Vengeance Trinket, Void Waker, the lot. Oh, this guy's Scald, what the hell? Why are you Scald, brother? Why is this guy Scald? PLS, 55. Pop him like it's hot. 20. I see a lot of people asking my questions, what's the difference between a Scald guy and a not Scald guy? A Scald guy, it's super hard for them to escape because there's a seven second timer that comes up when they're about to click Telly, but an unscald guy, they can just insta Telly if they've been out of combat for seven seconds. This guy is out of food and he is out of the game. Good fight, man. Got nothing. <laughs> you shouldn't have Scalded up, brother. You became a target. Feet Licker 3, can I catch a freeze? Bro, <laughs> you farmed me enough in B3, but B4 is a whole other story. Feel us? Void Waker, dead. Dead. Oh, the 48, how's he tank that? How old the 50? Oh my God, good fight, bro. Good fight. He said I farmed him enough in bracket three. We're in a whole new bracket, bro. Three mil loot. Five keys, let's see what they got. Come on, give me like 10 mil cash in one of them. This is six mil in the last one. I'm opening that first, dude. Two shadows and 200K, that's off the PK. He must've PK'd those and put them in this bank. We'll go backwards, 600k, 1 mil, 1 mil, and 355k. Another breach farmed, a lot of good loot. All right, let's sell everything in our inventory and see what kind of cash stack we can get to. 1 mil for that, 200k for that. What are these cannonballs gonna go for? 788k, what are those ancient staff gonna go for? 514k, what are the dragon bones gonna go for? 400k. Let's see what these jabs will insta sell for. 64k, are you trolling me? God damn. I might keep the axes just for the banks, maybe. I guess I will, yeah. Let's see what these glories go for. 500k. Let's see what the glory sixes go for. 1.1 mil. God damn. I think I'm only like 15 mil away from a toxic staff. I'm pretty sure I could find 15 mil in my bank if I tried hard enough. Let's sell everything in this inventory. What are these going to insta sell for, I wonder? 2.2 mil. From the blood runes, 1.5 mil. I'm very interested about these. 10k sharks sold for 2.4 mil. Yeah, this will be real easy. 
All right, I'm at 49 mil. I'm sure I can find another six mil in here. Now, while I was selling all this shit, trying to buy a toxic staff, that same Spudward guy came to the G and asked me to fight. So I told him we could at the duel arena once I was done with my trades. 55 mil. Ooh, it bought for 55 mil exactly, let's go. The toxic staff gives me more damage than the Zuriel staff. And it also gives me the spec bar, which makes one ticking easier, as well as the ability to venom people without a Serp Helm. Now it's time to go fight that PK. Oh, that's a chance. Oh, that's another chance. Oh! Dead. Come on. I think he's dead. I'm just going to auto cost him. And we did manage to get him. It was a little bit dicey there towards the end with the freezes. Up 260 damage, which is around four brews. So he was really packing them for that fight. And he almost made it to the bank. GG bro, 45 mil kill. Obviously it's gonna sell for way more. By the way, I was under the impression this guy was actually a streamer called Spudward, who's a pretty decent PKer. But I found out later that it's not, and it's actually a good single PKer pretending to be him. Subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed that kill. Good fight to the boy Spud. Let's see what kind of loot we just got from his key. 25 mil, bro. Oh my god. All right, let's sell all this shit. B ring for six. 
Oh, let's see what his DFS goes for. Let's put him for 40 mil. 42 mil, bro. Holy fuck. Selling that guy's entire set got me to 103 mil cash after I've already bought the toxic staff. I'm at 103 mil. Oh, Missouri body, Missouri chaps brought for 55 mil. Nice. Damn, that's gonna be a little bit harder, huh? Let me sell this VLS too. I haven't done that yet. Missouri body F, 62 mil, please. Damn it. I'm just gonna leave this offer in for the Missouri body at 63 mil. Okay, if I die for all this, it's gonna be one of the biggest deaths in DMM history. I sold some more shit and up my Missouri body offer to 71 mil. And now it's time to go PK in our new gear. Oh shit. Oh shit. VLS, 47. Again. What, a zero? It must be a glitch. I'll just go through prayer, fuck it. I don't think this guy brought a spade. Oh, I've got my thing. Nice. Thirty-eight barrage. Holy shit! The ancestral's popping off. Six hundred and sixty-six k. One mil loot off this guy actually. Had two hundred fifty k cash for us. Did this guy just teleport in, or did he just log in? Either way, catch a freeze. Go for a bolt. That's not big enough. VLS. Karasi fifty-two. VLS him again. Oh, he changed prayers too. That's legit crazy. Whack that. Come on. I need some better hits. What's this guy plan of escape? Feel us? Less. Surely I can freeze that nice. He's gonna go for the bank now. Again, 36. He smited here. Big bolts. Zoom. Damn it. Come on, big hit 50. Just go again. Raj. That's not the hits we needed. Come on. Freeze that. Nice. Dude, the damage is crazy right now. He just went under. He just went under. He legit doesn't give a fuck. I can't do anything about that, can I? He died. GG. Ooh. VLS. One more. Ho, 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 ho. This guy thought he was going to come get his defender. Unfortunately not. Jesus Christ. 400k loot. We'll sell for probably a lot more. We'll see what's in that key. We'll help us in our quest towards that Missouri body. 2 mil loot down 350k cash. Thank you, Mr. Lockie. I decided to go on a little solo adventure around the Slayer Tower, hoping I could find someone in big loot or a PK air. Found a PK air. I actually found a PK air. What the hell? Feel less that? 27? Crossy? 33? Feel us? Oh my. How's he so lucky, dude? How am I splashing that too?
BLS, his whole team's here, dude. His whole fucking team's here, so once he gets to that ladder, he's gone pretty much. Off, he says. I'll sub. <laughs> I do not know about that one. Three, four. Splash. They just boxed. They actually just boxed. So you see in my chat box it says GX Scoop is fighting another player. It's because they went up and down ladders enough times for me to get out of combat with him. And instead of him hitting me or one of his friends hitting me, Drench God and him just got into combat upstairs, which means I can no longer attack him at all and he gets to escape. Boxing is against the rules. You can see he was there with two of his friends and I did 377 damage, but he just used combat with his friend to get out going up and down a ladder. 400 damage, I almost killed him. Ooh, is this guy AFK? Please be AFK. 51. Come on. Crossy. Oh, ho, ho, ho. I misclicked a little bit there, but it didn't matter. I got it off in the end. Jeez, Ancient Staff, buddy. That's like a max kill right there. Can't be risk. Wait, did I just see 4k cannonballs? I did. That is legit bank. Rune arrows sell for a lot. Ancient Staff sells for 500k. The 4k cannonballs will sell for a fuck ton too. GG. Oh shit. Oh shit. Where's he running to? Does he have some sort of agility? Bro, what is this paw thing? It actually makes no sense. I'm actually very happy I found someone here. Is that a chain mace? I'm pretty sure these were going for like 250 mil 07 at the start of uh... How did he know it's about to cross him? This guy's some sort of hacker. This guy's some sort of hacker. Come on, Baltz. Pog off. VLS 63. Oh, he just killed himself to my venge, bro. That is unlucky. Uh, Ursine chain mace as well. That is a lot of loot. Thank you very much, brother. Jesus Christ. Hopefully that sells for a lot still. Let me check the prices. It sells for 9 mil as of a day ago. Don't mind if I do. That guy was probably farming, never getting attacked. Chain mace should sell for pretty, quite a bit. Let's check these two keys out. One mil, straight up four. Oh, we got a five miller. 400k cash straight up. I think that's the guy who I got for all those cannonballs and stuff. And five mil from the revs guy. Oh my god, bro. Just straight up rev loot. This guy wasn't mulin at all. That is money. A very successful day of PK, and if I do say so myself. A max kill on a PK and a ton of upgrades. And I do think this Missouri body will sell overnight. I just genuinely think there are none on the market right now. Once that buys, we are looking to upgrade our Ancestral to Virtus for even more damage. So make sure right now that you're subscribed so you don't miss the next video because the risk is only going to get bigger and better from here. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one.